Hey guys, welcome to the shop. Today we're looking at our new Mr. Heater Big Buddy Heater. This is the model MH18B. We're going to do an overview of it. So let's get started with all the different features of it. First off, what comes in the box? You're going to have two things. You're going to have the Mr. Heater fully assembled and the manual. That's all that's in there. You're going to need to buy your own propane tanks and your own hoses if you're using the larger 20 pound tank. But let's look at the features of this. The Big Buddy heater, compared to its little brother, has two places to put one pound propane bottles. They're on either side. And as you see, they have regulators on them and they pivot up where they're easy to screw the bottle into. So that's a real nice feature. As well, the other feature on the right side of the Big Buddy heater that the Little Buddy and I believe the Flex don't have is it has a quick adapter hooked on there so you can hook your hose up easier. So you can use the one pound propane bottles and you can put two of them in or just one and it'll run. As well you can have a 20 pound tank that's going to give you a lot more fuel and you can hook up on one side or you can hook up two of them if you're wanting to have a long time without ever having to change any tanks. But that's one of the nice things is it doesn't have to have two one pound tanks to run. So it has a nice grill. It has two burners in it compared to the little buddy that only has a one burner. It has three heat settings, low, medium, and high. One burner plate runs on low and medium. And then when you turn on high, they both run together. Also, if you're gonna run it on high, they recommend two one pound propane tanks. The low is 4,000 BTUs. The medium is 9,000 and the high is 18,000. It is rated to heat 450 square feet, which is about the size of a two car garage, making it an excellent choice for those do it yourselfers who have workshops in their garages. It has a built in igniter. You simply push the red handle down and turn it. And that click will give the spark to start the pilot light. Safety features. It has a tip over deal. As you'll see here, if you can hear that, it tips over, it shuts itself off, as well as it has a low oxygen sensor. So if it's not getting enough air to it or there's not enough oxygen in the room, it's gonna shut itself off, which makes it a great option for emergency heat for in the house because this is rated for safe indoor use. But when you do that, be sure and read your manual. There are some different safety things. Also, I always recommend, and what we use here in the shop, is a separate carbon monoxide detector. So we detect any high levels and give that warning that, hey, we need to crack a door or something like that. Now, the next question is, what size tank to use? A one pound or a 20 pound? Now, there's pluses and minuses to both of them. If you wanna know what those are, Simply click the little link right there and it'll take you to the next video. Or if you don't have time, click the subscribe button or our logo down below and you'll subscribe to the channel and can easily come back and watch the next video.